It is 5 o'clock in the morning, and I'm getting on my first flight of the day to get to Love Wrestling, uh, Force Wrestling's first event where I will fight Mitch Clark in a submission match. And I am so excited for this match. Uh, first of all, I love submission matches. Second of all, M Mitch Clark is a mixed martial artist, jiu-jitsu black belt, and a pro wrestler. He's going to have submissions that I've never seen before, and I'm looking forward to showing him some that he's never seen before, and uh, hoping to pull out the win. Uh, we'll see how it goes. He's much more experienced than me uh, with grappling and stuff, but this is pro wrestling, where I think I have the experience edge, so we'll see what happens. Oh, and security took my makeup, so I don't know what to do. The skull makeup is really important to me and my character, and yeah, now I can't do it. I'm hopefully going to be able to buy some once I'm there. So yeah, we'll see. Maybe it's just black around the eyes today. You never know. What makes it even more confusing is they took the remover. That makes sense. Take the remover. But they took the white and then left the black. And it's both the same substance with different colors. What the fuck? I have arrived here in Edmonton and uh, Love Wrestling has taken really good care of me, giving me the superstar treatment. Uh, I still don't know what I'm going to do uh, about them confiscating my makeup. I'm going to try and get some, some replacement makeup. Um, but now I have a few hours to rest, get some sleep because I was up at 4.30 in the morning and I didn't get to sleep until after midnight, so I'm on very little sleep. Uh, after been two flights, it's I don't even know what time it is anymore, but I'm gonna get some rest and then I'm gonna hit the venue nice and early so I can get some reps in before I step into the ring with Mitch Clark. There's two fucking beds in this room. I don't need two beds. I'm one person. Wait a minute. That means one's for sleeping and one's for jumping. Nice. Upper deck. Tron. Middle floor. Floor seating. And we've never wrestled before. We never even met before today. I think we exchanged three Facebook messages, something like that. Uh, how do you feel it went? I think it went good. A lot of a lot of good things. Things we can definitely improve on, but like it, it definitely got a good story across. And you know, it got me. People hate me, and people like you. And there's some definitely some really good moments for both of us. Uh, how did it when as you were healing, and how did he? Um, what went through your mind when they started singing my songs? Uh, I didn't want to take the the hope away. That was the important thing is that like it was like really playing that aspect of hope for you, yes. getting that sympathy, and then taking it the right moment to pull it away. That was the key, I think, was the, to pull it away at the right moment. Not too soon. Make them feel yeah. the moment. Yeah, I think it definitely worked out for maximum drama. Last question, what is your favorite spot in the match? Do you remember anything in particular that stands out? Uh, to be honest, while they were singing towards you and I was yelling, Oh no, the power of music. <laughs> and then when I dragged you away, I was like, no, just kidding. And people were pretty upset. So it, um, but there's a lot of good transitions, a lot of fun, a lot of good movements. Uh, I, I just, I enjoyed the match. Um, I think my favorite spot is the very unique suplex off of the full guard. Yes, yes, I do like cool. that. Yeah. Um, and we didn't even, we didn't even try, we kind of like set up for it, but we didn't go through it. Cool. But yeah, it was great to meet you. To meet you Thanks too. for doing this. Of course. And uh, I can't wait to lock up with you again. Should be fun. Absolutely yeah. back in my posh room with my six pillows in my sleeping bed. And then no pillows on my jumping bed. Um, they took my makeup remover at the airport, so I still have makeup smeared all over my face. I am exhausted. It is 2 a.m. Uh, I got four hours sleep. Man, I look like garbage. I'm sorry, everybody. Um, I got about four hours sleep uh, before the flight so 
I, I don't even know how little sleep I have before this flight uh, to get home um, because I haven't got my itinerary yet. So we're trying to figure that out. So, you know, not one crisis after another. Um, so I'm going to go to sleep uh, for what I can. And I'm going to see uh, how my back holds up um, and my back and my neck and pretty much everything. It's a long time without a match. And we went hard. And, uh, yeah, I'm really happy with it. Uh, I'm just glad that Spencer's uh, show was such a success. Uh, it was a great time. I'm here at the Edmonton airport. I have not slept. Uh, it was only two hours from when I stopped filming to when I got picked up. So there wasn't much point in me sleeping. So unfortunately, I didn't get, I didn't get to sleep in the hotel at all. <laughs> um, that sucks. And, and um, I'm going to Vancouver. I uh, didn't know that. So I'm going to make a brief stop in Vancouver, which I love. I love Vancouver. Um, and then, yeah, then it's home. I should be home by 1 p.m. And then I could finally fucking sleep.